rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. I didn't see you get on. My administration here, in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are Stop here it. to it's stay all I have or left. passing <laughs> Are you the only ones on that train? Oh, Welcome, Welcome to City 17. <clears throat> it's safer here. something in it to, to make you forget. I don't even remember how I got here. They never arrive. And the ones that do arrive, they, they never leave. You never see them go. They're always full. No one ever gets on, but they're always... Welcome. Welcome to City 17. You I see they took your suitcase, too. They can't get away with this much longer. To one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of Dr. Breen again? I was hoping I'd seen the last of him in City 14. I wouldn't here. say that too loud. This is his base of operations. Provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are here to stay or passing through on your way to parts unknown, welcome to City 17. It's safe. coupon just like everybody else. from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here, somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. 
Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon, good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. Thank you. <coughs> of course, your question touches on one of the basic biological impulses, with all its associated hopes and fears for the future of the species. You'll have to wait your turn like everybody else. Question. <coughs> What gives them the right to make this kind of decision for mankind? Will they ever deactivate the suppression field and let us <clears throat> again? Allow me to address the anxieties underlying your concerns, rather than try to answer every possible question you might have left on this. First the building, then the whole block. They have no reason to come to our place. Don't worry, they'll find one.
Dr. Freeman, I presume. We better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure he don't remember me, though. Man of few words, aren't you? Remember him from Black Mesa? Your old administrator. <laughs> Don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Through here. <laughs> 